scientists are, in, are interested in learning more about uh, asteroids for, for, for several reasons. Uh, first, to, one particular reason is to search for minerals, for example, on these, on these asteroids. Uh, recently, NASA was thinking about uh, grabbing an asteroid from the deep space and put it near the, uh, in an orbit near the moon so that scientists can have several trips back and forth to this asteroid to further study the composition of this asteroid and several other aspects about the asteroid. And uh, one of the ways to study asteroids is to send uh, probes to visit these asteroids and collect measurements from these asteroids. And the challenge in this competition was to send uh, three probes uh, from a mothership uh, vehicle to visit as many asteroids as possible within a given budget of fuel and time, collect measurements and return back to the mothership to deliver these uh, data to the scientific community. The students of, um, at Michigan Tech University over this past summer participated in the Global Trajectory Optimization Competition. And uh, this is a competition on, the, on space trajectory optimization. Uh, participants are from all over the world. We have universities from the U.S., like Michigan Tech, uh, University of Texas, Austin, and universities from Europe, from Russia, from China, from all over the world. And we also have uh, institutions participated in, the, uh, in this competition, like the NASA Jet Propulsion Laboratory, the NASA Goddard, the NASA Langley, uh, the European Space Agency, and so on. So all of these teams participated in this competition. It's a one-month competition. We, our space trajectory optimization team at Tech also participated, and um, they all solved one problem. And the, the problem that they were trying to solve this summer was to visit as many space asteroids as possible using a vehicle that has three probes. The vehicle deploys these three probes on a mission to visit as many asteroids as possible within a given a budget for the film and the time frame for the overall mission. All the solutions submitted by, by all the institutions got evaluated uh, and uh, the solutions were ranked and the Michigan Tech team was ranked 20 uh, among the 38 participating teams in this competition.